This is our bacteria overview figure. In this video, we'll be discussing Bacillus and Thrasis, which you can see right here. For this scene, we thought a giant ant hill would work well. Ant sounds like anthracis, so in this image, the giant ant hill should help you remember Bacillus and Thrasis. We've also shown some purple tents here because some hikers decided to set up a camp in this unfortunate spot. Who knows what they were thinking? Maybe they enjoy being eaten alive by ants while they sleep. Regardless, the purple color of the tents here should help you remember that Bacillus anthracis is a gram-positive organism. The tents will also be used to represent something else, which I'll discuss in a minute. But for now, just think purple color for gram-positive. This is a gram stain of Bacillus anthracis. Notice that the organism stains purple and is rod-shaped. Next, notice that we've shown several mounds extending away from the giant ant hill. This is meant to resemble a medusa head, which should help you remember that when Bacillus anthracis is cultured, it forms colonies with curled extensions at the edges, and that these are sometimes referred to as a medusa head. So several mounds going away from the hill that look like a medusa head for medusa head. Next, notice that we've added some hikers to the scene. These are the foolish goons that decided to set up camp right next to a huge ant hill. They must not be too afraid of the ants because they're right next to them. Anyways, notice that this guy's coat and the girl's boots are made of wool. The wool here is to help you remember that individuals who handle wool or animal hides are at an increased risk of developing infection. This is why Bacillus anthracis is also sometimes called wool sorters disease. So wool clothing for increased risk in people who handle wool. Notice that we've shown this girl holding an inhaler. Inhalers are commonly used by asthmatics to facilitate oxygen delivery to the lungs. So it can be thought of as a symbol for aerobic organisms, which are bugs that grow well in the presence of a lot of oxygen. So in our images, we'll be using inhalers as a symbol for aerobic organisms. Unlike the Clostridia species, Bacillus anthracis is an aerobic microorganism. So it grows well under aerobic conditions. So asthma inhaler for grows well under aerobic conditions.